Hi, this is Chris from Duffy Floors coming to you from one of my customers' houses that we just recently completed the floor work in. The customer wanted us to match or come very close to the pre-finished maple distress floor that she had in her kitchen and family room. She had red oak in the rest of the house that was just done with a natural polyurethane, which you know is very yellow and, and uh, doesn't carry the same tones that she wanted. So she wanted the, everything to flow through. So what we did here, as you can see, we did, uh, this is a pre-finished floor, the maple. It's a little bit wider than our, our oak floor that's here. But we had to just use some dyes and stains in order to get the color to blend as close as it does now. And I think we've got a, a pretty good flow or blend between the two rooms. As we, as we walk into some of the other rooms that we did, we did everything here on the first floor, plus a couple of flights of stairs. We used a dye stain, and then we used an oil stain on top of it. The oil stain that we used was uh, an ebony color, so that we could get the color that we wanted on top of the dye that we had, because we use a dye for the base tones, and then we add to them with the oil stains to bring the richness and beauty out of the wood. Here in her foyer, we had another challenge. She has a border in the foyer that she just did not like. It was American cherry and walnut against the red oak. And it really uh, showed different woods and all that, and she wasn't happy with the colors and tones. So I told her with our process of dyes and stains that it would sort of blend that all together. And it did exactly that. The American cherry is just a little bit darker. The maple is a little bit lighter, but it all flows together nicely with the red oak that we had. Uh, this is also a flight of stairs, the main stair treads that are here. The customer also uh, didn't want it as dark as the handrail is here, but wanted something that was gonna complement it also. So the guys did a great job here. We've got the detail of the Scotia molding and all of that. And even look, you guys did a great job keeping the stain off the base. We try uh, our hardest to keep things neat and orderly, but um, you know, I always suggest that you do have to do a little touch up afterwards. As we flow into the living room here, you can see that when you look at the floors on an angle, it tends that they're very dark and black, but when you get right on them with the sunlight coming in, you can see the grays and the brown tones coming through. And that's exactly what she wanted in order to flow through and, and blend in with her kitchen and family room. So this is Chris from Duffy Floors, and we have another satisfied customer here. If you need staining work done on your house, on your floors, if they're looking old and tired, please give us a call. This is Chris from Duffy Floors. I'll see you next time.